It's Ryan again, the agronomics production specialist here at Rockaway. And today we're gonna do some PGR applications. Um, what we have is the two gallons of Atromec PGR that I mixed up earlier. We'll do a visual inspection, make sure that we don't have any leaks or anything broken. Everything seems to be tight working here. I've got my gloves on, long sleeves, boots, long pants, properly protected. And what we're gonna do is just show a quick application of PGR. So normally what would happen is with the trim crew, they would come through and prune all of the hedges, get them nice and tight where we want them to be. And the second step would be to come right behind it and apply Etramec, which is our plant growth regulator, which will more or less help freeze them in time where they're at. It doesn't work the best right off the bat, but with the continued treatments as we've been doing over the past year and into the future, it really helps fill out the plants and just create a healthier, more tight look overall. And it reduces the amount of trimming that we need to do on the plants. So what I like to do is when I'm approaching to the shrubs here, we got some ligustrums here that we're gonna be applying to. And what we want to make sure that we're doing is only hitting the target plant with our application. So you really don't want to get this stuff on any flowering plants or non-target plants that we're not going for now, as well as the turf grass. It's not going to be as severe as something as, say, your Roundup application where you'll have dieback, but it can cause different types of chlorosis and health issues with the grass or any non-target plants that you're going for. With this application, it is a foliar application. So again, we're looking to get the product onto all the leaf blades of the plant. A proper foliar application, especially in this instance, would be you wanna apply until there's runoff. You don't wanna have too little bit of product where you have just dots everywhere, and you don't wanna soak the plant down where it's dripping all over the ground, uh, wasting product, wasting time, and you're over applying in that sense. So what we'll do is begin here, make sure that we're going up the side and down onto the back area. Trying our best not to do too much overspray, even though it can and will happen. We're moving over to a viburnum hedge here, same thing. It doesn't take much to cover And you can see even just in this application here, we've got a lot of drift because we're up a little higher. But if you want to zoom in on the leaf blades and you can see that most of them either are covered in droplets or barely dripping, but they're not oversaturated and they're also, the droplets aren't too sparse. So we have really good coverage from our flow zone backpacks and we can continue on. We have this nice, these podocarpus columns here. Same thing, you're gonna have a bit of overspray, but as long as the bulk of your application is going into your target, you're not gonna have too much issues here. And again, we want to make sure that we're getting the backside of the plants as well, because wherever you're spraying is where you're going to have your effectiveness. If you don't get behind the plants, you're going to have a lot more to trim on the backside, creating a lot more work for you down the line. And it also is very apparent on the customer side when they look at the plant. It looks real tight, but someone forgot to cut the hair on the back of it. Thank you for joining me on today's training video. And the whole idea behind it is to help make you a better professional and have you more familiar with the tools and chemicals that you're working with throughout the day. So following the video, we're going to take a short quiz on the topic of today's video. And then continuing the education, we're going to go into some more videos on other topics just to help get you up to speed. And so you can be the professional that we need you to be when you're out working on these properties with our customers.